Hey, what's going on guys? It's Mr. Hino with Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. Today's video is going to be some strategies with this medium motor right here. And for those of you that do FLL, some definite strategies and things to think about with this medium motor. All right, ready? Let's get to it. Okay, so the robot I have here is in previous videos, I've called it the booklet robot, but it's actually called the uh, educator robot too. If you hopped on the internet and just Googled um, educator robot or Lego EV3 educator robot, um, this is what you might find. So I just did a quick little search and that's what you would get. There's different variations, uh, color sensor down, color sensor forward, uh, you know, just a driving base without the motor, gyro sensor. So any one of those would get the job done to build this robot here. So let's take this over here to the table. So on this medium motor here, there are some definite strategies. This is the uh, Nature's Fury FLO board. So there's some strategies on what to do with this medium motor here. Obviously, if I took this uh, attachment off, it, you know, the motor could spin. So there's obvious, you know, variations on how to use this medium motor. But a lot of times in FLO, you're going to use this medium motor to either drop things off or pick things up. So in this case here, we have this uh, dog and cat. And then looking at the objective here, one might think, oh, okay, we might, you know, have something go through this opening right here and pick it up. But, you know, with FLO, you have to play your percentages and your odds. Would it be better for us to go up here and you know, get really lucky, get right through here, right in the middle of this tubing. Yeah, he's missing his nose. Um, and pick him up, or would it be better percentages if we came down over there and actually dropped the gate on him? So when you're thinking about FLL and your missions, you have to always keep in mind what are your percentages? What is more accurate? Um, what's going to be better for you and your team in order to accomplish this mission here. So what I have on this program here, this is actually a brick program just because, I don't know, it was not hard enough to actually do on the computer. But here's, let me just show you really quick the program. So we would have a forward for 1.75 seconds. The reason I put a stop on here is if you don't, um, the robot actually ends up going backwards before the gate actually completes its, um, you know, coming down. So I have the stop for, you could have made it for anything, but it's on for two seconds. Sorry for the glare, guys. And then there's the medium motor block right there. And if I want the gate to come down, I actually will drop the bar. And then you have to have it for a time. What I really love about this particular robot here, I don't know if some of you had this issue before, but when I drop this gate, notice right here, these pieces, those curved beams, don't allow this gate to go down any further. I've seen cases where this gate goes so far down, it ends up pushing, and if you want to do a backup, it lifts the, it lifts the robot up and it's really hard to go back. So I, I like these pieces right here that prevent this gate from hitting the mat and then lifting the whole robot up. So what I want to do is just go over here and grab that dog. And then I actually, on the program, have that backwards to come into base. So let's see how it goes. Let me back up over here. And I bring that all the way back into base. So. I, in my opinion, would have found that a lot easier to do. I mean, if we were to try this 10 times, I might be able to do that 9 out of 10. But it's so much easier to do that than to try to go through the tubing and pick it up a different way. It's just my opinion, guys. I mean, with everything that you do in FLL, you, you play the percentages. What what best odds do we have of completing it? And you always try to go with what, what gives you the best odds. So there you go. Today is our medium motor, um, basic strategies using that in your FLL competitions. 
And hopefully you found that interesting, guys. Okay, we are back from spring break, and hopefully you had a good one, and we're back in it. All right, guys, I am Mr. Hino for Mr. Hino's Lego Robotics. I am out.